Hello all, welcome to a new episode of GitHub Copilot. In today's episode, we will explore how we can pass a custom coding standards as part of the Copilot code generation. Normally, Copilot will align to or follow the coding standards from the open files or the context provided as part of the prompt. If there is no context or open files are available, Copilot will uh, stick to the industry standard based on the technology stack. So sometimes when you work with some legacy files or the files which is not adhered to any specific coding standards, you may need to enforce the coding standards for the newly developed code or the newly developed code should follow a certain coding standards. So let us see how we can enforce such coding standards through a workaround kind of setup. So let me move to the code base here. I have a Python file here with a certain standards followed. In terms of the function name itself, it's a Pascal case. And it's not the actual Python standard followed. So let me just ask Copilot to define a function for verifying palindrome. So I'm planning to add one more functionality here for checking palindrome. As you can see, this currently have some kind of uh, coding standard issues here. It's already pilind is there. That's why it's uh, uh, highlighted the coding standard issues. But as we have supplied this one, the palindrome, the functionality implemented using the similar uh, coding standard. So it's used the context as the input. When you deal with a legacy program, most of the time, the code may not have proper coding standard. Even the modern development, sometimes the team forgot to implement a proper coding standard. Then we end up in creating a similar kind of issue prone or not a standard or up to the quality code. So how we can fine tune these things? So let me supply the coding standard as a JSON file first. You can define the coding standard using JSON, XML or YML kind of approach. Here I have the coding standards defined using JSON file here. The classes should have a capitalized word Functions, I am looking at camel case. Uh, even I can specify that function should have a snake case. Snake case is nothing but exactly the similar manner. Each word will be separated by an underscore kind of thing. And the constant should have a upper case. Uh, so this is the uh, coding standard I have provided. Even the comments and uh, the doc string uh, style needs to be followed. So let me select this as my input and request the copilot exactly the same requirement using my coding standards so i have provided this json as an input and asking Copilot to define a new function using this particular coding standard. As you can see that it's taken the function name as the snake case because I have defined snake case here and it's given the doc string. It's aligned to the style, numby style of the comment is provided and it's given the complete implementation. So this is how you can pass it the coding standard or I'm going to pass it as a YAML file. Here the function is given as snake case. Let me change to um, camel case. So camel case is the way I need it. And I am going to ask the copilot. After selecting this coding standard defined in YAML, define a function to Calculate the radius of a circle using my coding standard. Even um, 
if you have a different standard or anything you can pass it and copilot chat have the context or session details for some time so it adhered to that after that so if you look at here as we mentioned the camel case the function name is camel case the remaining everything doc string is numby style and everything the exactly the similar pattern is used everywhere so now if i ask for uh, define a function for verifying palindrome and there is no need for selecting or specifying that one as it's already taken this as the coding standard it start adhering to that one it's a function name is camel case and the variables are snake case and if you have any kind of constant defined here it can come as the uppercase with underscore so let us see how we can get that one so i am going for define a function to calculate the interest of an amount define the interest rate as 5 percentage so i'm not calling out the coding standard or anything and but it's referred it's already and it's going to define the interest rate and everything so you can observe that the interest rate is uppercase with underscores that is the format it's used so similarly you can define your coding standard but it needs to be supplied to the chat after some time the chat may forget these things so you need to have the coding standard supplied to the chat after 10 to 15 chat messages it may forget that and again roll back to the context supplied or the standards defined so always better to start with a coding standard and after two three interactions supply it again as the reference kind of thing so it's not learning or anything copilot will not learn from your data unless you go for the newly released customized models approach this here it's actually taking the contextual information for aligning the coding standard as well Thank you.